Local law enforcement officers train for tragedies like the one in South Florida. Deputies learn how to deal with the stress and the emotion when responding to a school shooting scenario. News Channel 8's Chip Osowski joins us now with that story. The sad reality is in today's society, a mass shooting could happen in any facility, a mall, a movie theater, or even a school like this one. And deputies have to be prepared. Get back inside. They went to the library. Who is he? What's his name? What's he wearing? At the Hillsborough Sheriff's Office training facility, the school shooting scenario is a video. But make no mistake, this is no video game. Show your hands. Everybody out. Here's Dexy. Keep your hands up in the air. Keep your hands up in the air. Instructors tell us this is as real as it gets, minus real victims or real bullets. When your body is put under stress, it goes through a bunch of physical changes. You get that adrenaline dump, your heart rate gets faster, you know, your breathing gets shallow, and that's what this simulator does. Our job is stop the violence, and that's the most important thing we can do. Corporal Benjamin Kenny works with the school resource officers and has been through the training. And while it's meant to keep deputies focused on the job and not their emotions, he sent a note this morning thanking them for what they do. I sent him a message this morning thanking them because I know for a fact that any one of those deputies would lay their lives on the line and they would lay their lives down to protect my children or anybody's children, your children. Every Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy has to go through that training, not just school resource officers. Other law enforcement agencies in the area also have similar training programs. In Brandon, I'm Chip Osowski, News Channel 8.